Best have been together for over eight years and are showing us how they make it work in business and in their personal life on this season of Marriage Boot Camp Hip Hop Edition. Please welcome CeeLo Green and Shawnee James. <laughs> Before we get started, I have to ask, CeeLo, it is rumored that you are on the UK version of The Masked Singer. <laughs> <laughs> is there anything that you can say about that? I've heard the rumors too, and um, <laughs> I don't know, maybe it's me, maybe it's not. I know the internet is having a lot of fun with it, mm. so I won't spoil it for anybody. Okay. You know what I know? I know that I too sat on this stage and lied and said I wasn't <laughs> you know on The Masked Singer. <laughs> so there's that. Well, something we we know is a fact that is probably not a rumor is that you're getting back <clears throat> with Gnarls Barkley. Yes. Oh, yes. yes! Oh, my God! Yes! So, what is it like getting back together? It's wonderful to, um, to reconnect with um, such a musical um, counterbalance. Uh -huh. um, such a great and talented guy, Danger Mouse, the producer is. Oh. And uh, for the people that really love the project, um, they're, they're really just eagerly anticipating it, and so am I. You know, so um, I can't wait for people to hear the new music. We can't wait that either. So yeah. Yeah. It's, uh, it's probably one of the most, um, sorry, yeah. probably one of the most impactful and important things that I've ever done in my professional career. Wow. Really? Yeah. Oh, good. We well, can't wait for that. Oh, God. Well, shiny shine. Hi, Hi Sean. So Sean is a celebrity. Just, you're a celebrity stylist. You styled me before I was a celebrity. Thank but you. But <laughs> do you give CeeLo any fashion advice? You know what's funny? CeeLo actually gives me the fashion advice. Hey. Wow. Really? Yeah. yeah um, he often calls me his muse, so which is really Aww. sweet. You know, I'm into vintage and. Um, he really got me into vintage, so he opened up a whole new world. Oh, for me. It's so wow. Thank wow. you. Wow. Stunning. Wow. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> wow. Wow. As you two have been together for eight years. Yeah. And some would say fate actually brought you two together. Yeah. How did that happen? Okay, I'm gonna try to make a long story short. Okay. okay. <laughs> We were both in Canada, coincidentally, on separate business. <laughs> um, I was doing a performance there. She was there. Um, I was doing, her yeah, a meeting and doing a presentation. Okay, so a friend of hers uh, knew that she was a fan of my music, mm -hmm. and she was like, well, he's doing a performance here. We should go. But I think she had a presentation earlier that morning, so she couldn't make it. So we missed each other there. Then we both flew back to L.A., and I was just moving to L.A., and I was about to start on The Voice, so I hadn't even gotten a home yet, a car, or anything. So I was car shopping on La Cianica, um, and my back was to the, to, the, to the street, and I heard this voice over my shoulder <laughs> say, Hey, I love you. Keep up the good, good work. <laughs> and I turned around, and it was her. I said, Me? And she said, Yeah, it's you, you. I said, I love you. Keep up the good work. I said, Well, I love you, too. And you know, for me...